see those in bed. I gave him his pills and everything. Mm. Maybe, um, you can make him breakfast in the morning? Baba? As someone whose life has been touched by Alzheimer's, it is such an honest and, and touching portrayal. And you also add this um, narrative on top of this young man performing drag and, you know, the resentment of his father, although he's still there taking care of his grandfather, um, there's still this tension and that it's heartbreaking and it's something so common for so many people out there. Um, so many, um, LGBTQ youth, um, that are still a part of their family and cohesive and there's still that tension. It was just, it was a really touching, beautiful story. Um, I think it was incredibly well played out. Um, the cinematography was so beautiful. Um, it all came together, the acting, um, the lighting, the, the soundtrack in the back, all of it. It was just so, so lovely to watch. I really loved the dynamics that they had going on and the, the kind of love and affection between you know, the the kind of kid and his grandfather. I'm pretty sure it was his grandfather. And I like how they showed you the kind of strange relationship that he had with his dad. And even, you know, his dad with everybody, including the, the grandfather as well. And that there wasn't any like judgment or shame when the grandfather showed up at the work um which there could have been so I like that they didn't go with that route and that it was just love and support and then you get this like beautiful tender moment between the two of them this was such a touching intergenerational short I love the tender portrayal of the young man who is so patiently caring for his grandpa. The cinematography is vivid and creative, and I really appreciate the poetic soundtrack in the film. Though a complete narrative, I would love to see more of this story in a full-length feature. I really enjoyed the performance by the whole cast. Um, they were really sincere in their performance. Um, I really enjoyed the, the linear narrative. Um, I thought the pacing of the story was really well, uh, was really good. Um, and I really enjoyed uh, just the way that it was set up and paid off at the end. Um, I thought it had great cinematography, uh, really good use of light. Uh, so great work. Generational differences were also coming together and family and everything like that. And it was, it was very beautifully shot and beautifully acted. The, uh, person playing the man playing the grandfather was very good um and general is very beautifully shot beautifully acted a beautiful story um i think it was very well made and i really liked it they touch on topics that are so intense and intimate and they do it roughly and with just honesty uh it it was great the script is amazing the casting as well and the circumstances they touch on are also quite similar in the cultural sense of things and how things are approached by different cultures and in this case maybe patriarchal figures from fathers and it is uh, an interesting depiction of situations that it touches on Humans are always carrying something or carrying pain or experiencing something hurtful. And it really, this film really touches on that. So you have three different main characters that each on their own are experiencing something. 
some sort of pain and how they process that was just brilliant. This is a beautifully told story. Um, it's really also a story about three men and their relationship as son, father, grandfather, so nicely done. I love the cinematography, all the different colors. It sort of had a retro feel for some reason to me. Um, everything was great about it. The music, the song, when the son was performing as a drag queen. Um, I just, it was great because I, I also felt like the writing was really good because to me it wasn't a lot of exposition. It really just kind of let the story tell itself and didn't underestimate the audience's intelligence at all. I felt like it was so, such a sweet story. Um, and acceptance of, that the grandfather has, even if it's because he's thinking of his wife, um, just all of it was really well done to me and re presented really well. And I actually want to see more. I wanted to see this more of a feature. So um, really well done in tackling um, these subject matters um, and the fact that the father, the father of the younger son wasn't really present and the son was taking care of the grandfather and the grandfather was developing this relationship with his grandson. And, and it, the whole thing was just heartwarming. It's about acceptance. It's about, you know, maybe the, the, the father wasn't really accepting the grandfather, his dementia or Alzheimer's, and it was more the grandfather and the, the grandson accepting each other. Mm -hmm.